sure why we're here except to go for a walk but I'm glad to be here and uh, in the immortal words of the apparently immortal Keith Richards I'm glad to be anywhere Kusay very interesting these days you don't have a bakery you have a vending machine distributor de baguette a man with a chainsaw as usual when I take the camera out and right next to his house, a gorgeous memorial to a hubcap. If only hubcaps were treated like this everywhere. Right next to a daffodil, somebody has left their snotty tissue paper. In America, they have signs in the country that say, leave no trace, which is great advice to the whole of humanity. But uh, who will heed it? For a moment, I thought I'd found another hubcap memorial deep in the forest, but I think it's something else. There's a woodpecker up there somewhere. But the minute I switched the camera on, woodpeckers shut up and um, 
chainsaws start normally. Leave no trace campaign. Item number three detected. A discarded tub of chewing gum. On the theme of leave no trace, I'm always reminded of a letter that D.H. Lawrence wrote where he said, um, I'm not too troubled by the idea that one day humanity will be wiped out. I rather like the idea of an empty field with the head of a rabbit popping up. You're right, Marlo. Oh, item number four, a discarded dandelion. No, that's supposed to be there, isn't it? Item number four, wrapping from a packet of paper handkerchiefs. Discarded item, I can't remember which number. Um, a gate with a letterbox and nothing behind it. Discarded item number six, a tin of mackerel fillets. Minus the mackerel fillets, but stuck on a little stick.